An OVF template is a virtual machine or virtual appliance encoded in open virtualization format. You can easily export virtual machines as OVF templates and deploy them on vSphere or on a different VMware platform. VMware supports OVF, a multi-file format, and OVA, a single file format. When you deploy or export an OVF template for the first time, you are prompted to download the client integration plugin, which you download and install only once on each machine. The plugin is a small application that allows the web client to save things to and load things from your local hard drive. You download and run the plugin just like any other Windows application. When the installer prompts you, you must close all browsers, including the browser that is running the vSphere web client. After you've closed all browsers, click Next to install the plugin. Click Finish when the installation is complete and restart your browser. To deploy an OVF template, log into the vSphere web client, right-click the vCenter server or the host where the OVF will run, and choose Deploy OVF Template. Specify a source URL for the OVF template, or click Browse and select a file. Click Next and review the OVF template details. If prompted, accept the license agreement. Now that you've picked an OVF template to deploy, you must specify where to deploy it. Select a folder or data center and then a host. Select the virtual disk format and the destination data store, and specify the network the OVF template will use. You can usually accept the default settings for storage and networking. For some OVF templates, you can customize the deployment properties of the software solution. Which properties you can customize depends on the source virtual machine. Click Next, review your settings, and click Finish. If you want to share a virtual machine with others in your company or in the VMware community, you can export the virtual machine as an OVF template. In the vSphere web client, find the virtual machine you want to export, right-click the virtual machine, which must be powered off, choose All vCenter Actions, and select Export OVF Template. In the Export OVF Template dialog, specify a name and directory and select the format, which can be OVF or OVA. If you want to include the BIOS, UUID, MAC address, or extra configuration, click Enable Advanced Options. Selecting these options limits portability, so don't use them unless you have to. When export is complete, you can make the OVF template available on other environments that support the format, such as vCloud Director, or deploy the OVF template on vSphere. For more information, see the VMware Technical Resource Center or visit pubs.vmware.com.